Oh, what do we got here? A sparrow? Fox sparrow, maybe? Let's see if it... Oh, just on the tree there. Seems to be just checking me out. All right, let's put the camera down and see what we can get. Oh, I can hear some hummingbirds zooming around. Okay, well, let's keep seeing what else we can see. Definitely heard a hummingbird. Oh, that was it. Oh. That was quite a bit of activity. Singing in here. See some mallards in that marsh there. There's definitely some hummingbirds. Oh, what do we have up there? Looks like a kinglet just landed up there. It's taken off. A couple of chickadees just came to say good morning. Are you guys gonna give me time to set up my camera? This would be great. You're right here. All right, let's see what we can do. Have a little snack there and let's grab your photo. Okay, put on the camera here. Taken off. Okay, well, that was a cool start. I'll get some nice photos. Lots of birds around. Oh, what do we got in there? A lot of the times when there's this many birds, it's hard to uh, concentrate and pick one out at a time to identify and get a photo of, and not just to, like have your head on a swivel. <laughs> That's part of the fun too, though. Birding is whatever it is to you. And to me, I like chasing them and trying to get some photos. And then figuring out what it was that I actually got a photo of. Oh yeah, there's a beautiful Rufus. Oh, you can hear it. Okay, well, let's see if we can spot it again. The Rufus hummingbird, they've just arrived. And they'll be here all summer. They breed here. They we're super lucky. One of my favorites for sure. Let's see if we can see if he lands. Oh, we may be walking around looking for hummingbirds today. That'd be pretty fun. 
I haven't seen two before this morning. So I knew they were going to be around, but I think there's quite a few. Mallards are coming to say good morning. Grab a little You wanna stay still so I can get your No? You guys are too close for me. I don't have anything for you to eat. Alright, I can back out my camera a little bit there. Okay. Got your stock mallard. Nothing fancy there, but let's keep our eyes on these. And these All right, it's quieted down, so let's just walk back to where we saw those chickadees. See if any birds have uh, come back to that area. It's a kinglet. Oh, okay. Oh, my chickadee. Okay, thank you. That was great. That's a good spot. Let's set up right here first. Oh, the kinglet. Now the kinglets stay still for about half a second. So, i to uh, get where I can kind of shoot in every direction here. Got some crows up here. And then over here, there's something large. Let's see. Not there. There. Yeah, what have we got here? Okay, let's move around and see what that is. Could be a heron? Yeah. There it is. Yeah. There's a heron hiding up in there. And these aren't the greatest shots, but basically I'm just oh, just got a buzz looking for identifying photos, photos that you can identify the bird with. And then obviously I love getting beautiful ones, but there might have been another heron that flew overhead as well. Well, that's cool. Okay, well, I got it pretty well. Let's see. Oh. Okay. Where's this hummingbird? Oh, there we go. Okay, let's see if we can find this little flight pattern. Maybe it's nearby here. So usually there's one that it's doing the dive bombing and another that it's dive bombing. <laughs> I think it's mostly just a, a mating, mating dance. Oh, 
They seem quite wild. Oh, these hummingbirds are <laughs> all around. I've seen one so far I was able to spot that sat still, and it was definitely a rufous. Great coloring. Okay, well, we'll keep moving around. We'll get a shot. So we'll see what else there is. See what else wants us our photo for now. We'll see Rufus in a bit. Hopefully. Oh. Okay. He's like, I'm right here, buddy. Where are you? Hopefully those little guys are showing up on the the walking cam. And if you get the chance, if you happen to be watching my videos, try it on a big 4K TV. That's what that's how I watch my own videos. I figure that's like the best way to you know give you about as authentic as I can of a birding or my birding experience. This is very authentic. Sometimes you stand here and hear a bunch of birds <laughs> and none of them want their photo. Crow flying overhead again. Okay, well, let's walk around. We'll keep our eye open for the, um, the hummingbirds. Because they probably are my favorite. Pretty stealthy today, though. And then uh, we'll see what else reveals. And then every time I see that, hummingbird goes zooming by. And, you know, you can spend all day taking, trying to take a photo of a hummingbird, or you can whiz through here and see 30 or 40 different species in 20 minutes. You know, and there's these little hungry mallards. All right, we'll keep looking. There's nice even lighting right now, so if there are some, oh, there's the heron flying overhead. Let's see, there it goes. Okay, it seems like there's quite a bit of activity here. Quick little glance over the You know, just do a scan to see if there's anything that pops out. Other than your... It might be a bit rarer than a mallard. Because <laughs> I'm pretty confident I could get a mallard shot. Oh, that's a red green blackbird right here. I recognize that. That's the first one I've heard this year. That might be it up in there in the tree there. 
see. Looks like some juncos are flying across there, but everyone seems a little camera shy this morning. Hmm. Okay, well, let's keep cruising. It's all part of the fun. This is a chickadee singing. See some pigeons and Canadian geese. Let's grab a quick shot. You know? Working through some new gear here, so. Kid and goose behind a rock. <laughs> With a couple rock pigeons. Oh, there we go. Okay, so he heard me. All right. Yeah. All right. We got a pigeon, why not? There. Okay. Oh, what do you got here? And sparrows. And some juncos. Okay, there they are. Awesome. Try not to scare them, let's see if I can go a little closer. So we got here. Junkos. Those are some geese coming through. A bit nicer than on the sidewalk. <laughs> see, you get to see the magic of photography. On one side, you can have Canadian geese on the sidewalk, and the other, in pure nature. <laughs> oh, and look at this. This is what I love about birding. I'm just gapping away, and look who's just sitting in here. 
great blue heron. Do the weed dance. And as you can hear, we're right by some construction. <laughs> All right. Okay, that's cool. Okay, well, let's get out of here because this isn't great for birding videos. Let's see if I can sneak by him without disturbing him. Get away from all the construction noise. Let's see what we can do. He's on the move here. Let's just see. I think he sees something. Then maybe we will hang out by the construction. Oh. oh look at that, he got a catch. Okay. And then I walk by. Do my best not to disturb him. And isn't that the truth? You got amazing nature right behind construction noise. <laughs> See, this guy can have one more bite. Oh, they're so cool. Okay, well. No one likes, no one likes being watched while they eat. So I'm gonna, I'm happy with that. And let's move on. Let eat in peace. Right, let's see what else we can find. Get away from the construction noise. There might be some kinglets out of there. It's a loudy day, birding. <laughs> That's a big bird. Radial saws and um, beaver airplanes. So sometimes you just have to use your eyes. <laughs> and there's lots of locations to go. Like, you know, and this this happens to be I don't know, marsh in a pretty urban. Uh, 
uh, environment. Um, but it's beautiful that nature's got a spot. Even in the urban area over here. Looks like we got a chickadee up here. Okay, well let's stay to my word. Try to get a little bit of ways away from the construction sound. Is a tiny. Not sure what this is on here. Very small. Oh, cool. You gotta know the field guide for this one. See if we can get far, see any other characteristics on it. Oh, it's feet. Yeah, so whenever I see something I don't know, I try to get as many photos as I can, and then, and I find this pretty exciting when it's It's quite small. It's like the size of a kinglet. It's kind of spot like it looks like it's spotted or not spotted, but it's, oh, it looks like it's um, streaked like a pine siskin, but I'd say it's way smaller than one. Okay, come on, move around a little bit so we can get a, some other views of you. Rufus over there, or sorry, yeah, Junko. There we go, okay. Well, maybe this be a siskin. Oh, okay. What we got up here? Oh, did I get the kinglet? Looks like we got a ruby crown kinglet, but they, like I said earlier, they stay still for half a second. So they're a lot of fun to try to shoot and focus on. Okay. Let's get away from the noise. The noise, the noise, the noise. <laughs> Here though. There's a junko and there was a tohi, the spotted tohi that we heard call. Give it a sec, see if they come back out. Oh, there's another sparrow in with them. And there's the tohi's call. Unique call. Almost like a cat. Yeah. You want your picture, Mr. Toy? You know, Junkos. Yeah, once the uh, leaves start coming in here like this, it obviously creates a new challenge. Um, and I think you just, you know, you just have to camp out a little bit longer if you're looking for the nice photos that I enjoy getting, but I just enjoy being out here. 
All right, Toby, we'll see you later, hopefully. So if you see something or hear something that I'm missing, please make a comment. I, you know, I would love to learn more. I mean, that's what that's what we're always doing, right? We're always learning. And I'm missing all sorts of stuff trying to juggle this gear around. And, you know, but I, you know, I'm doing it so I can share and And yeah, I would love to uh, have any tips or anything, that you, any comments on uh, how I go about the way what I call birding. <laughs> go about missing photographs of beautiful birds. Oh, what have we got here? Oh yeah, there's one. Silhouetted back there. That one might have been a not a Rufus, but what the soon to be renamed Anna's hummingbird. Some gulls flying overhead. Okay, let's see what we can get here. Oh the chickadees are back. Maybe I can get the Decent shot of my friend. There they are. Let's see what we got here. Are you still here? Did you let me set up? No. Okay, well, I'm gonna keep the camera on there. Just let's see if we chill here for a few minutes, see what happens. Oh, here he's got nesting material. Where are you going with that? Oh, now that is cool. It's like, there's a nest. A heron nest right there. I saw it. I thought it was a smaller nest. There's two in there. That's very cool. Two. 